Hi, welcome to Learning Monkey. I am Raghuir. In this class, we do some practice examples on discrete probability function or not. You know, previous classes we already discussed about what discrete probability function is. Please watch that class and come back here. This is just practice examples for better understanding of discrete probability function. The link for the playlist is provided in the description below. Coming to today's class. So discrete probability function or we call it as probability mass function. If you if a function want to be a probability mass function, it has to satisfy these two conditions f of x greater than or equal to 0 or sigma all x of f of x is equal to 1. These are the two conditions satisfied by our function. So why it has to follow that explained in our previous class. Coming to the examples. Check whether the following can serve as probability mass functions or discrete probability function. Given first one is f of x is equal to x minus 2 by 2 for x is equal to 1, 2, 3, 4 values. So can you can this function is served as a discrete probability function? No, this cannot be served as a discrete probability function. Why? Because when you substitute 1 here, we are getting a negative value. Negative values are not allowed in our probability mass function. And coming to the next one, second uh, example, h of x is equal to x square by 25 for x is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. Is this function can be served as a probability mass function? No, we cannot serve it as a probability mass function. Why? Because sum of five probability values, if you substitute them or if you add them all, we will get a value of 6 by 5, which is greater than 1. It should be equal to 1. So this function cannot be served as a probability mass function. This is how we identify that. And we do one more example for a better understanding. A random variable x has the following probability function, probability mass function. This is the distribution they have provided. They are trying to ask, uh, find the k value. 0, k, all these values has been provided. For This is the random variable x. For that, the probability distribution is like this. And from the conditions, we know that sigma all x probability of x is equal to 1. So from that, we will get a 0 plus k plus so on equal to 1. If you substitute, finally, we will get the equation 9k plus 8k square is equal to 1. 8k square, 8K square plus 9k minus 1 is equal to 0. So if you solve this equation, we are not going to explain how to solve these equations and all those things. k is equal to, we will get k is equal to 0 0.102 nearly. So this is what the k value is. Hope you understand these examples. If you have any questions regarding the concepts, please post your questions in the comment section below. Thanks for watching. If you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe to our channel and press bell icon for the latest updates. Thank you.